I truly believe that the election was not stolen, but I do believe it was interfered, such as all the bomb threats and yeah, well, we, to that nature. Well, definitely, we definitely know it was interfered. I agree with you. That there's a hundred. Right. That's a hundred percent. Russia interfered, and the bomb. Th- you're a, you're a hundred percent because we can back that up with facts, Mark. That's why. Right now. About two days ago, I was listening to the po- a podcast, and I don't know why it popped up on my feed, because I never followed this guy. I don't even remember his name. But a very high-ranking official from the Democratic National Campaign was talking, and I was listening to him. And he stated that the Democratic Party and the campaign is severely broken. And the reasons he gave was that, number one, they're using the same consultants from twenty, uh, from two, the year two thousand, it's the same people, the same consultants with the same ideas, and they're not connecting with new voters. Now realize that every year, Brian, there's a whole new flock of voters that are el- people that are eligible to vote. Right, right every right, year, right. they turn eighteen and they can vote. Correct. We're not connecting with them. And the same consultants are worried about how going on MSNBC, right. CNN. That doesn't work no more. You have to go on every single podcast, you have, and you can't what keep a, discussing. Mark, what have I been? What have I been preaching yeah, for months? For thing. months, I was Thank begging. You. I was begging Harris, and yes, okay, she did an interview with Brett Baer. That wasn't enough. Okay, I was happy she no. did the Howard Stern show. That wasn't enough. I was happy, that, and I thought they would do more. I would love to know. I would make so many mistakes. I would love to know, Mark, if I get the chance yeah. to talk to a Quentin Fulks, who, by the way, has done this show before. He basically ran Kamala Harris's campaign. I would love to speak with him and say, why did you guys not decide to do the Joe Rogan show? Why did you guys not decide to do Newsmax or OAN? Why did you guys? They were protecting her, bro. Right. I, 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 I think that's the answer, but I'm trying to figure out how they would spin it. They're the ones, in my personal opinion, that are most responsible, besides the people who obviously I hold to account, who decided to vote for Donald Trump. You know how, okay? right. you know how they would spin it? You know how they would spin it? How they so? would state, well, she's going to be talking to MAGA voters anyway. That, was, that would be their answer. Well, I think that's a really stupid answer, and I think it's part of the reason why exactly. she, I think it's really part of the reason why she lost, Mark. I, I'm in complete agreement with you, and I think it's wrong. 